Continuing the Union Prayer Book for Jewish Worship Revised Edition edited and published by the Central Conference of American Rabbis Part 2 Cincinnati 1942 and the original was 1922 which probably should have meant they would uh, should have used modern English, but, um, well, at least 1900s English. Lord being God as a noun and a verb, I believe that song, uh, the responsive reading is from Psalm 39. O Lord, thou hast searched me and known me. Thou knowest my down-sitting and mine uprising. Thou understandest my thought afar off. The congregation. Thou measurest my going about and my lying down, and art acquainted with all my ways. Whether shall I go from thy spirit, or whether shall I flee from thy presence? If I ascend up into heaven, thou art there. If I make my bed in the netherworld, behold, thou art there. If I take the wings of the morning and dwell in the uttermost part of the sea, even there would thy hand lead me, and thy right hand would hold me. And if I say, surely the darkness shall envelop me, and the light about me shall be night. Even the darkness is not too dark for thee, but the night shineth as the day. The darkness is even as the light. How weighty also are thy thoughts unto me, O God! How great is the sum of them! Search me, O God, and know my heart. Try me and know my thoughts. And see if there be any way in me that is grievous. And lead me in the way everlasting. And the minister. Grant us peace. Thy most precious gift, O thou eternal source of peace, enable the upright of God to be a messenger of peace unto the peoples of the earth. Bless our country that it may ever be a stronghold of peace and an advocate of peace in the councils of nations. May contentment reign within its borders and health and happiness within its homes. Strengthen the bonds of friendship and fellowship between all inhabitants of our land. Plant virtue in every soul, and may the love of thy name hollow every home and every heart. Inscribe us in the book of life, and grant unto us a year of prosperity and joy. Praise be thou, O God, as a noun and a verb. I think it's Yahweh there. And maybe add down nine, which is leader of the community, giver of peace in the choir. Amen. And after the silent devotion, we have Alhi Batsur. O God, keep my tongue from evil and my lips from speaking guile. Be my support when grief silences my voice, and my comfort when woe bends my spirit. Plant humility in my soul and strengthen my heart. With perfect faith in thee, help me to be strong in trial and temptation, and be meek when others wrong me, that I may readily forgive them. Guide me by the light of thy counsel, and let me ever find rest in thee, who art my rock and my redeemer. Amen. And the choir. Let the words of my mouth and the meditation of my heart be acceptable in thy sight, O Lord, my rock and my redeemer. The minister of the congregation rises, and the minister and then the congregation says, Establish of our, of our environment, Our King, grant us a year of happiness. The the establisher of our environment, our King, have mercy upon us and upon our children. The The establisher of our environment, our King, keep far from our country. 
pestilence, war, and famine established for our environment. Our King inscribe us for blessing in the Book of Life, the established for the establisher of our environment, our King, accept with mercy and with favor our supplication, and then the congregation sits down. And remember, ab is the same root in the word for serpent, as in particularly a spiritual creature that reminds people of snakes. Remember the ancient Egyptians said two main things about the unseen beings that were male or female that either compared them to fire or to snakes. But we're not talking snakes here, we're talking ab, which can be a term used for father, but it goes beyond that, just like am. Um, the congregation rises, and the minister and con then congregation says, Abhinu Mulkanu Chaddash Alyinu Shana Thuba Abhinu Mulkanu Chamul Alyinu Wal Wal Aul Linu Wath Pinu, Abinu, Mokanu, Kala, the Burr, Wachrub, Warab, Malyanu, Abinu, Mulkanu, Kitbanu, Busper, Chiyam, Thubim, Abinu, Mulkanu, A Bull, Birch meme. Were burnt soon at Tep Let New. And the congregation sits and might want to fill in and make a sermon as if the 21 to 40 hour prayer book is not enough. Um, or, it's, you know, you have more time, right? And the adoration. The congregation rises, and the minister, and then the congregation says, Let us adore the ever-living God and render praise unto him who spread out the heavens and established the earth, whose glory is revealed in the heavens above, and whose greatness is manifest throughout the world. He is our God. There is none else. We bow the head and bend the knee and magnify the King of kings, the Holy One. Praised be he. And the choir one to new crying, one shut to him, one one him, Lapni, Malak, Malki, Hamlakim, Huck, Douche, Baruch, Hua. And the congregation sits, and the minister says, May the time. Not be distant, O God, when thy name shall be worshipped in all the earth. When unbelief shall disappear and error be no more, we fervently pray that the day may come when all men shall invoke thy name, when corruption and evil shall give way to purity and goodness, when superstition shall no longer enslave the mind, nor idolatry bind blind the eye, when all inhabitants of the earth shall know that to thee alone every knee must bend, and every tongue give homage. O oh, may all created in thine image, you know, every image, uh, God forms an image, and then the creation follow, the matter follows that thought, Recognize that they are brethren, so that one in spirit and one ah, and one in fellowship, they may be forever united 
before thee. Then shall thy kingdom be established on earth, and the word of thine ancient seer be fulfilled. The Lord will reign forever and ever. We know that if you look into Near Eastern religion, that the usage of crystals and mirrors and stuff, um, whether by imagination or by the fact that they reflected something, there was said to be a transfer. So by that we um, are by just the flow of the mind bringing out stuff because of these reflections, not just the imagination thing. Um, so that gives us insight into that belief. It's not that we look like God or anything like that. And the congregation. On that day the Lord shall be one, and his name shall be one, and the minister. Thou, O God, art our loving provider, and we are thy trusting intelligences. We thank thee for the manifold blessing which bringeth our life, and we pray unto thee for strength and light. When sorrows darken our way, thou hast hallowed the home as a sanctuary of thy spirit, and thou hast consecrated our dear ones to minister at the altar of love. In thy goodness hast thou given them to us, and thou callest them to the eternal home, when in thine infinite wisdom it seemeth best. Thou hast implanted within us an immortal hope, which speaks comfortingly to our hearts, that through the body which is of the earth returns to the earth, the spirit which is of thee returns to thee to live forever. Yea, even in this world our beloved still live with us. The yearning of our hearts tells us that true love never dies. Help us to make the memory of our dear ones a lasting inspiration and to consecrate the thoughts of them through noble deeds and loving service, with bowed heads and mourning hearts, yet with abiding faith in thy justice and loving kindness, we sanctify thy name. And the mourners rise. The minister says, Extolled and hallowed, be the name of God throughout the world which he has created and which he governs according to his righteous will, just as he in all his ways and wise, just as he in all his ways and wise are all his decrees. May his kingdom come and his will be done in all the earth. And remember the he and his is a gender neutral thing. So we're not saying that God is male. And the congregation. Praised be the Lord of life, the righteous judge forevermore, the minister. Whosoever praise we would render, whatsoever praise we would render unto God, howsoever we would adore the Most High, we would yet fail to give glory due to his great name, even in the hour of bereavement and sorrow. We feel the majesty of God and would give thanks for his manifold mercies in the congregation. Amen. The minister. To the departed, whom we now remember, may peace and bliss be granted in life eternal. May they find grace and mercy before the Lord of heaven and earth. May their souls rejoice in that ineffable good which God has laid up for those who fear him. And may their memory be a blessing unto those who treasure it. And the congregation says, Amen. The minister. May the worker of peace send peace to all who mourn and comfort all the bereaved among us and the congregation. Amen. And then they sit and remember, let's pray for those who have lived up to their confident. Um, and for those who are still alive, who can be guided, let's pray for them to be guided. But let's continue on here.
and the mourners rise. Yit gadol, wheat gadush, shemah raba, palma di, bra kura wuta, weem leek, mul kuta, bachi yakun, wabi um yakun. Wabchi Duckel Bait Yashral Bogla Wub Zaman Arib Wamru Aman Yaha Shmah Raba Mabrak Lalam Wal Almi Almia Yet Burk Weesh Tabach Wheat Par Wheat Rumum Wheat Nsha Wheat Hadder Wheat Allah Wheat Halal Shema Dakwacha Brik Hua Wala Man Kul Brkita Wash Yurta Tush Bachta Wun Chimta Dam Yurn Balma Wam Ru Amun Al Yisrael Wal Tzadikya Wal Kulman Dat Pathur Man Alma Hadyan Kur Auta Dalha Yaha Lahun Shulma Raba Wachulka Thubba Lachia Alma Dati Wach Sada Pur Chami Man Badam Mara Shamya War Aa Wamru Amun Yaha Shilma Raba Man Shimya Butiyam Al Yinu Walkal Yishral Wamru Amun Asha Shilum Bam Rumyu Wa Ya Asha Shalom Al Yanu Wal Kul Yisrael Wam Ru Amen. And people sit down again. Hold on, let me. In the closing hymn. Give glory to the living God and praise God who reigneth beyond the end of days. Thou only one who is like unto thee. Beyond men's ken throughout eternity. Bodied not in figure and form not found, No living thing thy holiness can sound. Thou wast ere the world its grandeur began, 
nor lives it within time thy being to span. God of the universe, source of all light, thy works all reveal thy glory and might. The power prophetic thy word to make clear, gavest thou unto those to thy service draw near. Like unto Moses no prophet has been, who more than all men thy glory has seen. Through thy faithful servants, the prophets, O Lord, didst thou thy message of truth accord. Neither God nor his law will ever change. Throughout all time they will endlessly range. From him there is nothing veiled or concealed. From beginning to end all things are revealed. Both the just and the unjust their portion receive. None faileth, none can omniscience deceive. In his own time, in his appointed way, will come his salvation for which we pray. He redeems the dead to life that endeth never Praise be his name forever and ever. And then there's some sort of benediction. But by morning, I'm not presuming. This is, is this following the regular dawn prayer for the Jews? Um, but the closing hymn, and I don't know the term, I, I don't know the, the tone taken with these closing hymns. Um, I do know Tra, tra a, or tra ao, is gates, and that relates to another video that I'm going to do before the night closes. But young dulao him chi wish ta bach nam sa nat al mats yao tu. I should win yet yet keeps one nalm wagum ain sooth latch do to ain lu dem what hung oof wainu goof la maruk ayu kanchatu kanmun kanmun lakal number asher number rashud wain rashid Lurashi tu Hanuadun Aulam Lakal Nutzer Yura Gadla tu Wam Lakutu Shapanabwatu Natnu Al Anshi Sagla tu Wat Partu la kam bishral kam sha aud nabuya wam yith atam tu tu radamat natan lamu Al al yanam yao nam bi tu la yuj leaf hal walayam yern the tu la lamin liz wal tu tu pa da. Satri nu mambith la thuv dmurmakan matu gumalish 
chasen kampalu nutan lursha rakursatu yashlach lakats yamyan pandut alam kalchi wishya kir yashuatu chi Aulam natha batuk nu bruk adi adjam tahlatu. And then there's a benediction. And yeah, I know there's dots. Um, and I'm not saying anything silent and some other stuff that people would expect, but um, that is is how it goes. I'm trying to give a more lasting connection to the language or a more a more direct instead of later interpretation which comes through in some of the marks. And I know some of it is after the Mesoarch text, so but I'm hearkening to the pre, before the historical appearance of Judaism, before the historical appearance of what could be called Judaism, to the origins.